Today is my teacher's birthday. It's your teacher's birthday. You excited, Aria? Yeah. You ready to see the gift basket, baby? Yes. Okay, I need you to stand right there and close your eyes. I'll put it in your arms, okay? Okay, I'm so nervous. I think you're gonna love it, though. You ready? Yes. Open your eyes. Wow, everything's so soft. Everything's so soft? Yeah. Do you think she'll love it? Yes. And what's that? Some slippers for her feet. Huh? Slippers for her feet. Oh, they're very really soft too. Mm -hmm. What'd you say, Aya? You did a very really good job. I did? Yeah. You think she'll love it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay. She will be very happy. She is? Yes. Okay, let's go put it in the car, Mama. Uh, she's not very mad. She's not going to be mad? Yeah. Do you think she's going to love it? Yeah. Okay. Is yeah. All right, guys, we have made it. It's time to drop Aria off. Aaliyah doesn't have school this morning, and we're going to go take her her gift. Ugh. Now, I'm not going to show y'all her or her reaction. I probably am going to record her, but it's just going to be for me and my family. But we're getting ready to go inside, guys, and I'll let you know how it goes when we come back. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm getting some food, and then I'm going to park and let you know how the basket went. But I wanted y'all to see this part because every time I go to this Chick-fil-A and this specific worker is here, he is always so nice to me. And I just love the vibe that he gives me when we're at Chick-fil-A. So I'm going to show y'all. Watch. He's so nice, y'all. He is so sweet. And he just makes me feel like that good grandpa feeling. Like, I just... <sighs> you'll see. You'll see soon enough. Asia. Asia, that's what I thought. <laughs> You're awesome, Asia. Oh, thank you. You and your beautiful smile. <laughs> God bless you. Thank you. Your hair too, man. It looks <laughs> fabulous. Thank you. Got a nice little wave in it. <laughs> You're looking good, girl. Thank you. And how many children do you have? Uh, four all together. You're amazing. <laughs> Super mom. That's amazing, Asia. God thank bless you. you and your family. Can I have some Chick-fil-A sauce? Sure. So nice, y'all. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Have a good day. You too. Y'all, did y'all hear that? He is so sweet to me. Oh my goodness. Now, let me park and then we're gonna actually, dang, the parking lot is wrapped. Okay, well, let me just drive and then I'm gonna just go ahead and head to Aria and then we'll have a chit chat. Cause when I say this parking lot is wrapped, y'all, it is wrapped. Okay, so the basket. The basket went really good, y'all. Really, really good. She was actually shocked to receive it. She had like this <gasps> face. She was like, oh, really? Like, wow, thank you so much. And I'm like, yeah. Now that you got my baby in your life and you treating her how you treating her, baby, your life gonna be good around your birthdays, around your Christmas. We got you. No, I'm playing, but <laughs> I really hope that she really soaks it all in and do the care package and bup getting the, I don't think I bought her any bubbles. It was Epsi salt child me and epsi saw like this so i hope she really just soaks read the letter put on the fuzzy socks i should have got her a robe but i got her at blankets y'all forgot to put the dang on blanket in the thing and now i don't kind of want to bring it after the fact because it's like i took it out the packaging and stuff so it'll kind of look like hand me down ish so we just gonna cross the blanket off the list that's just not <sighs> i'm so upset it's a fuzzy blanket too. I feel like I should still give it to her. I don't know. I still gotta send her a text of the photos that I took of Aria holding the basket. So I'm gonna text that to her later and then I'm gonna tell her like I actually forgot to bring your blanket. So. Okay, and then I done messed around, got on the right side of the internet, found some more of my people. So now I got 500 subscribers, y'all. Five, dude, five. 500 subscribers 500 subscribers y'all like i just can't even i'm gonna try not to cry but every time i talk about something that's near and dear to my heart and since i done got in tune with my emotional side and i understand that crying is an emotion <laughs> and it's not something bad i used to think of crying as something like ew what are you crying for like it's not that deep but it's literally just an emotion you have to express it and ever since i unlocked that part of my life y'all i just be crying 
crying when something really just hit here. And I'm not ashamed to say that. It's just sometimes I'd be like, dang, I'm really gonna cry. I, I, my goal is to not cry on this vlog, but talking about my subscribers and my people and y'all who truly, truly value me enough to be like, subscribe. It just really just brings up some tingles in me because it's just like, I'm really finding my people y'all like I'm really finding my people that just makes me so happy and I just know in the future I'm gonna be sitting here talking to you guys I'm gonna have a million subscribers it's gonna be vlogmas and I'm gonna be like okay y'all ready for our annual vlogmas giveaway I'm giving away trips I'm giving away gifts and don't let me get Mr. Beast big because now I'm like okay one big one big house giveaway raffle like I just oh I'm a gift giver and I love to give gifts to people that I love. So I just know as my platform grow and I continue to be bigger, my gifts to my supporters are just going to get bigger. And I just love that for y'all and I love that for me. And I love that I have this platform where I'm able to be authentically myself and people are able to vibe with that because I will never ever be anybody else for the internet. And that's one thing that like y'all can guarantee. I'm me, I've always been me. And I'm going to continue to be me no matter how many people watch me. And I love vlogging. It's something I've always loved. I used to do it when I was a kid. I used to do it when I was in middle school. I used to do it when I was in high school. I just didn't know that like people get paid for it to be honest. So this isn't out the norm for me. Vlogging seems normal to me. It seems how some people would say seems like it comes easy to you. It's because it it just naturally does. It's just something I enjoy. Like I love doing this. I've never felt this way about a career path so it makes me feel like this is my career path i love being a mom i feel like i was put on this earth to be a mom and that's crazy from somebody who never wanted kids so i just feel like god knew what i didn't know about myself at the moment i ended up pregnant because i'm like who finna be a mama not me now look at me i'm thriving child the life that i thought was the life prior to being a mom is crazy Crazy. like the amount of love that I thought was love prior to being a mom is crazy like I met my amazing husband I met my amazing kids and like that's love that is that warm fuzzy feeling I used to search for as a person and I'm just thankful enough to live a life where I'm able to be a stay-at-home mom I'm able to just follow my career path follow my hobbies that's not something a lot of people are fortunate to do because you know you gotta work a nine to five in order to just live so I say all that to say thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you from the bottom of my heart and I can't wait until I'm saying the same thing all over again when when I hit 1k 2k 3 4 5 100 500 a million like literally I love it here so much. <laughs> but let me go get Aria and then I'm gonna go ahead and shoot home. Hey guys, I made it back home and I wanted to show you my porch. I literally am not playing pumpkins right here. Still got the fall pillows out. Like, y'all. <laughs> it is December. It's about to be the second week of December in like a day, right? We about to hit Thursday then Friday. Tomorrow's Thursday, so. I don't know. I think I'm low-key am still in fall vibes in my head. I am delusional at this point. Cause, but I did want to take a picture out here because the fit was fitting. The decor. But it's not fall. It's winter, right? When does winter officially start? Anyway, let me prop y'all down so y'all can get the fit. Hold on. Some slice, some slice. Hold on, peep the shoes, peep the shoes. Ooh, don't do it, Tom. Don't do it, Tom. I need to put the Christmas decor out, right? Comment down below if I should put the Christmas decor out. Cause I mean, Loki's still a vibe. Let me know. Yeah. All right guys, I was finna stay and kick with y'all a little bit longer, but I'm not going to lie to you. Vlogmas in terms of like getting sleep. Since I'm a small creator and it's new to me and I didn't complete it last year and this is my first year completing Vlogmas this year, it's taking a toll on my sleep. I am exhausted y'all, exhausted. And I be having so many ideas, but at the same time, I wanna keep my videos fairly short, about 15 minutes or so, and we done hit our mark. I'm getting the flow of things and I'm starting to feel it. And it feels like this is too long to edit. <laughs> for vlogmas so with that being said y'all i'm gonna rest to go through the rest of this footage 
try to get me a nap in. I don't know, I, I'm scared to nap at this point. Every time I nap, it's too long. And I gotta edit this and I'm gonna roll to 1K. So I gotta get on my Zoom. Now with that being said, they brought out the pill. That dude, my kid's going crazy right now. <laughs> Ain't no sleep. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And always keep it cute. See you tomorrow. Bye.